In November 1974, Peter Pierce was in New York making his debut at the New York Metropolitan Opera. He was singing there the role of Aschenbach in Britain's last opera, Death in Venice. In that same month, this was the letter that Britain wrote to him. My darling heart, perhaps an unfortunate phrase, but I can't use any other. I feel I must write a squiggle which I couldn't say on the telephone without bursting into those silly tears. I do love you so terribly. Not only glorious you, but your singing. I've just listened to a rebroadcast of Winter Words, and honestly, you're the greatest artist that ever was. Every nuance, subtle and never overdone, those great words, so sad and wise, painted for one, that heavenly sound you make, full but always coloured for words and music. What have I done to deserve such an artist and man to write for? I had to switch off before the folk songs because I couldn't take anything after how long, how long? How long? Only till December 20th. I think I can just bear it. But I love you. I love you. I love you. B. From My Uncle Peter to Ben, written in New York, November 1974. My dearest darling, no one has ever had a lovelier letter than the one that came from you today. You say things which turn my heart over with love and pride, and I love you for every single word you write. But, you know, love is blind, and what your dear eyes do not see is that it is you who have given me everything right from the beginning from Grimes right up to this great Aschenbach. I am here as your mouthpiece and I live in your music. And I can never be thankful enough to you and to fate for all the heavenly joy we've had together for 35 years. My darling, I love you. Peter. <laughs> 